Well, hey everybody, this is Down the Wormhole, and today we are fixing Orion's tank. As you can see, he is up in the video room. He shares with my goldfish and a few other bettas and the ball python. So let's get started. This is him. This is Orion. We have had him for a few months now. He is on his third shed for us and growing so awesome. He's getting quite tame and used to us, <laughs> and I definitely love his attitude. He is a king snake all around and just a sweetheart. <laughs> we are getting quite used to each other, and I really enjoy taking him out now. Right now I'm currently feeding him two pinkies a week, but I think I'm gonna probably get him the next size up the next time I go get some mice. He is growing so well. We're kind of spoiled here and we have lots of options for going and getting food for him. Lots of local breeders and of course local stores as well, which stock a lot of the locals as well. So we've got some really great choices for food. I feel very spoiled. I could probably go buy mouse, mice from a different person <laughs> every time I go. I have discovered it is very hard to tell where we are in the camera when I can't see it. Sorry, I kind of lost my snake for a second. So I'm just going to take him and put him in a bucket here with his plant. And we're going to clean this all out and redo the whole thing. Right now we've got a divider in it. When I first got him, he kind of stressed out and really wasn't eating. He was searching the tank a lot. And so we made the tank smaller. We've kind of decided since he's grown some and gotten used to us a lot more, we're going to take the divider out. So we scrub everything down simply with a toothbrush. Get all that poop out and start cleaning. <laughs> Using the dirt in there is definitely a little harder to get it all out, but I do enjoy it anyway. I of course had a helper for the whole time. It was awesome. So here is our final product. I do hope he enjoys it. I am actually really enjoying just fixing up his tank. I'm finding it almost easier than the fish tanks. <laughs> the leaves are just out of our backyard last year. We used no pesticides or sprays or anything so that I could use our natural materials as well. A nice big water dish because these guys do like to soak and I think he enjoyed it too. I love watching this guy move. I find it just fascinating. His colors, patterns, everything on there just makes it a lot more fun. His favorite place to curl up is in the shell at the far end, which is also his hot hide. having the tank decorated like this does sometimes make it a little more awkward to get poor Orion out when we do want to play with him but so far it's not stopped us he does enjoy digging in the dirt and making the odd tunnel especially while it's wet I did manage to catch just a little bit more of the second shed or the third shed here sorry he actually caught it on the seashell, which I thought was really, really neat. So it does serve more than one purpose. But thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys found this interesting. I'm loving this guy, and I will see you guys all next time.